It's Liz, it's The Summit, and Audio Technica Studio C. Pleased to uh, welcome Jessica Lee Mayfield back to Studio C, and this time she's here with her brother, David Mayfield. Welcome, guys. Hey. Hello. You guys can clap for that, too, if you want. <laughs> We've got an audience of Summit members here today, and uh, we're going to have a few songs from Jessica and David. You guys are on the Sibling Rivalry Tour. It's wrapping up tonight in your hometown at the Kent Stage. Um, I believe show starts at 8, is that right? Sounds show, good. show always Sounds starts Sounds about stage, right. So. <laughs> um, but welcome. Thanks so much for coming in. And uh, I want to ask you guys before you play a song how you uh, came up with the idea for the tour. Well, the tour was actually David's idea. I don't know how he came up with it. It came to me in a dream. <laughs> uh, no, you, Jessica and I played... Uh, we, we grew up in a family band, so we've we've played music together as long as we've been playing music. And uh, and for years in, in Kent, we played every Monday night, just the two of us, and it kind of seemed like a fun thing to do again, uh, to get to play and sing together. Yeah, it's amazing that we've never toured like this before, but I doubt we'll have the time to, to do it again. You Ever. Know? We have, we just, we've had a lot of <laughs> off time, and he's he's getting ready to come out with a new album, and I'm starting to record, so once... Once we're, you know, promoting our own albums again, we'll be so busy, you know. Yeah, I was kind of wondering if you guys were maybe going to make an album together because you're going on tour like this, but it sounds like you both have your own projects that you're working on. We do. We've talked about maybe <clears throat> doing a little something we down the road. We could find an evening yep. to record it. <laughs> if if Audio Technica wants to give me a bunch of free microphones. If anyone here in the audience wants to we'll, produce we'll check it. in on that for you. <laughs> Why don't you guys play a song? All right. right. To the river of Jordan, our Savior went one day. We read that John the Baptist met him there. When John baptized Jesus in Jordan's rushing water, the mighty power of God filled the air. I'm on my way to the river of Jordan. Going to wade right in. In the rushing water. I'm going down. I'm going down to, to the river of Jordan. And let the cool waters cleanse my soul. King Nameth was stricken with dread and leprosy. They sent for the man of God to pray. The man then told Nameth, go dip yourself in Jordan. Let the cool waters wash your spots away. I'm on my way to the river of Jordan. Going to wade right in. In the rushing water. I'm going down. I'm going down to, to the river of Jordan. Jordan. Let the cool waters cleanse my soul. This mighty river I may never see But I'll find myself an altar in some old-fashioned church And that will be the river of Jordan for me I'm on my way to the river of Jordan Gonna wade right in In the rushing water I'm going down I'm going down to the river of Jordan And let the cool waters cleanse my soul It's Studio C. It is the summit. And the uh, Mayfield siblings are here. Jessica Lee Mayfield and David Mayfield. The sibling rivalry tour wraps up tonight at the Kent stage. Um, I want to thank them once again for coming in. Thanks, guys. Um, and it sounds like you're doing a lot of bluegrass covers, actually, on this tour. Is that right? Yeah, we're playing a lot of the songs that got us started into playing music in the first place and kind of, you know, paying tribute to you know, what has us doing what we do. Do you feel like you guys have sort of a different perspective, uh, you know, going into the music industry because, you know, David, as you mentioned, you guys played in a family band together. And Jessica, I think you started when you were like eight. Is that right? Yeah. So you guys got started early on the road. And I mean, you literally were like traveling around the country in a van 
for part of your childhood. It was, it was a bus, actually. We lived in, a, in a, a, an old bus that used to be owned by Bill Monroe uh, and Kitty Wells and Ernest Tubb had it for a while, I think. But uh, yeah, it definitely when when you uh, when you live on a on a bus, you kind of <laughs> it's uh, changes you, your perspective on everything. On everything, yeah. <laughs> so I imagine your parents are okay with your choice of career. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Um, we we really there's I don't think there's anything that Jessica and I and I could do. Other There's than music, we don't have any other skills. They wouldn't hire me at McDonald's, I don't think yeah. so. <laughs> David, are, you're the one who taught Jessica how to play guitar, is that right? Um, I, yeah, I did, didn't I? You showed me uh, the chords to Stone Temple Pilots' Creep, and then from there, that's how I started. Yep. For those of you, you who guys aren't playing that one tonight, are no. you? No. <laughs> for those of you who don't know that, that's the, the Stone Temple Pilots, if it wasn't for them... <laughs> yeah, and that, there wasn't a whole lot of chords in that song, if I remember correctly. It's about four. Yeah. <laughs> you guys both have uh, records coming out, Jessica, as you mentioned. Uh, David, you put out a really nice album called The David Mayfield Parade, and I think that was your first solo venture, kind well, of. I, well, right? I, had, I had done some low-budget uh, things throughout the years, but it was the first uh, kind of national release. And the... I believe the Avet brothers were the ones who encouraged you to go ahead and do that. Um, yeah, it, it was something that I had, had thought about doing a lot, and then uh, <clears throat> um, I went. I played with Jessica on on the the first tour where she went and opened for the Avet brothers, and uh, I got a chance to play some of my my songs for for those boys, and they said, uh, "Why don't you you ever think about making your own record?" And, so, and I think that everyone you know that knows you has always wanted you to kind of step out, out front. And this is, I'm excited for the new stuff that David's working on as well. It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're confident. Uh, why don't you guys play another song for us? All right. OK. What are we doing? Um, this, uh, since we've been paying tribute to uh, musical legends, and uh, songwriting geniuses, I thought I'd go ahead and do one of my original songs. <laughs> this is one called A Doodle Do. Oh, love makes us crazy again. Yeah, love makes us crazy again. There's no right way to write a song And no wrong way to write a wrong You'd be right if you left me And I'd be right where you left me And I guess I would have known all along That there's no right way to write a song And there's no good way to break a heart we two were too good from the start And there's always hurting when you end up reverting One whole back into its two parts And that's no good way to break a heart A woman will do little things to a man To make him feel less like a man and a doodle do things to a woman, it's true, that in turn make her do like she do. Oh. When it's all for one, two just for show, three is a crowd, I suppose. At four in the morning, five hours from home, when a warm friend is empty and cold. you come to that fork in the road take it give your little love a brighter day and make a little love along the way whichever is the way you decide to go when you come to that fork in the road cause it's not over till it's the end 
And this ain't the end again Those who give in to enough is enough End up giving up and then giving in But it's not over till it's the end A woman will do little things to a man To make him feel less like a man who can And a dude will do things to a woman it's true that in turn make her do like she do when we won't admit we can't chew what we bit or spit it out into the wind it's over my friend at least until when love makes us crazy again Oh, love makes us crazy again. Oh, doodle do do doodle do do do. I went real, real low at the end there. I couldn't hear you over the clapping. I went real low at the end of oh, this for dramatic low. effect. Oh, that's great. <laughs> It's Studio C, it's the Summit. Uh, Jessica Lee Mayfield and David Mayfield are here. They're playing tonight at the Kent Stage. It's the Sibling Rivalry Tour, and uh, it's wrapping up here in Jessica and David's hometown of Kent. Are you guys still located, like, based in Kent? I know you're on tour all the time, but I didn't know. Uh, I know David lived in Nashville for a while, I think. Yeah, I was down there for about six years, but uh, actually just relocated to beautiful Warren, Ohio. Oh, okay. And I live in Kent. Okay. Yeah. So we, we kept you guys in Ohio. That's good. Yeah, well, the real <laughs> estate market is crashing. <laughs> I bought a house in Warren, and they gave me money. <laughs> I wanted to ask you guys, you know, Jessica, especially on your record, there's a lot of songs that are pretty personal, you know, and a lot of sort of romantic love songs and things. Is it ever weird to play those, you know, David's toured with you as well. Is, is it weird to play those with a sibling, or does it just not really? No, I mean, David and I have uh, have co-written, you know, quite a few songs together, and I think he's, he's one of the only people that I've you know, co-written with, because, you know, we are related and, and so close that I feel like I could tell him specifically what a song is is exactly about mm -hmm. and then he could you know weigh in with his ideas on it otherwise I wouldn't want to tell you know someone else like you know oh, yeah this remember that one time <laughs> <laughs> yeah a lot of the, the personal things we would write about are things that we would talk about with okay. each other anyway so it's not too weird no <laughs> <laughs> is it easier touring with a sibling I mean yeah I guess I don't know I mean <clears throat> uh, well we, we, uh, we, we've gotten along pretty it could good. Be, it could be easier or harder, depending, you know, and where we are as siblings. <laughs> <laughs> depending on the day. <laughs> yeah, depending on what mood we're in. Uh, Jessica, you've had a, a pretty big year. I understand you got married pretty recently. Yeah. <laughs> so that's been good, right? Congratulations yeah. on that. We're, uh, we're creeping up on our... Uh, one year anniversary on the December 30th. That's great. So. Congratulations. Oh, thanks. Um, in terms of the new records, when are we going to see new stuff from you guys? Oh, for me, I'm about to start recording, so I have I don't have any ideas to win. Hopefully, sometime in the next year or two. But what, what about you, David? I, I just finished mine, so uh, it's hopefully early next year. Yeah. And that's going to be a David Mayfield parade release. That's correct. Cool. Um, anybody working with Dan in the Black Keys? Who? Dan Arbach? Uh, no. I don't know if you've not, heard of them. Not on, <laughs> not on these, these new projects. We're kind of, uh, you know, ready to do something different. Oh, yeah, definitely. It's, you know, it's what you have to explore, you know, different outlets. You can't, you know, keep, what is that expression? Like beating a dead cat or, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> can't keep doing the same thing over and over again, Yeah. you know. Um, do you guys want to play another track for us? Yeah, yeah, we'll play a, uh, a Dillard song titled There Is a Time. So are we, we would 
it's all green, a road beyond bear. Path is new, the world is free. The days will pass like summer storms The winter winds will follow after But there is love and love is warm There is a time for us to wonder Time is young and so are we The woods are green or over yonder The path is new, the world is free Summit, and uh, we have an audience of Summit members here today to see Jessica Lee Mayfield and David Mayfield. The sibling rivalry tour last show is tonight uh, in their hometown of Kent. Guys, welcome home. Thanks so much for playing for us. Oh, thanks for having us. Uh, do you guys have an opener tonight? Uh, yeah, Shivering Timbers. Actually. Oh, Shivering Timbers. Locals. I completely forgot that was on the bill. So, yeah, it'll be a good. Shivering Timbers, a great uh, band from Akron. So, if you haven't seen those guys, absolutely get to the show on time and uh, check them out. Yes, indeed. David and Jessica, thank you so much for uh, coming out and playing for us tonight. Looking forward to hearing new music from both of you next year and uh, music tonight in Kent. Oh, thank thank you. you. It is The Summit and Audio Technica Studio C.